G'day, can you solve this easy question involving wages in just a few seconds? Here it is. Which of the following options pays better? We have two options. The first option has a rate of $42,000 per year, okay, per annum. We have a second option, which is paying $23 per hour. So which of these pays better? These are both full-time jobs at 40 hours per week. I'll tell you what, I'll give you a lot longer than you need. I'll give you four seconds, but you should be able to do this instantly. Okay, time's up. Did you get it? So, which one of these pays better? Well, if you said the $23 per hour job pays better, you would be correct. Well, congratulations. It pays about $4,000 better off. It's $46,000 per year that this particular uh, rate pays you. So, how did I go through and get this really quickly? There is a way that you can convert between annual salaries and hourly rates, and you can do it instantly. And I'm going to show you this right now. So, First off, let me just give you a little explanation on how this trick works. So when we're doing this particular trick, it works on the idea that if you're working a 40-hour week, which is a pretty standard full-time job, you would be doing this for roughly 50 weeks a year, okay? 52 weeks in a year, but we're going to multiply by 50, so the number is pretty good here. That we get that roughly there's about 2,000 hours that you work per week. So if we're converting from an annual salary to a per-hour salary, we divide by 2,000, and if we're going from a per hour salary back to an annual salary, we multiply by 2,000. When we're doing this, it's a pretty easy way that we do this. Um, what we would do is if we're going from 42,000 and dividing by 2,000, well, we can first go through and divide by 1,000, where we're going through and just getting rid of three zeros here, and then we divide by two. Vice versa, if we're going from a per hour rate, we could multiply by two to get 46, and then multiply by 1,000 to get that annual rate. So let's do this right now and we'll see what our answers actually are. So when we talk about the 42,000 per annum rate, we can leave that, but let's have a look at this one here, the $23 per hour. First off, we're going to multiply that by two. And if we do that, we're going to get that this is 46. Okay, 23 times two is 46. And then multiply by a thousand, this rate is $46,000 per annum. So if you compare this one to this one, you can see that this rate, the $23 per hour rate, is actually much better by $4,000. In fact, we could actually change this $42,000 rate into a per hour rate pretty easily, divide by 1,000, boom, 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 and then halve our answer. So this would be equivalent to around about $21 per hour. So what do you think? Nice and easy, right? I tell you what, so easy, I'm going to give you two that you can do right now. So what about I give a couple of these that you can compare? The first ones we're going to compare is let's compare, say, an annual salary of $68,000. That's per annum. And we're going to compare that to, I guess, a per hour salary of, let's say, $35 per hour. You can look it straight away and wear this out. That's how good this trick is, actually. Uh, the second one is... What about we compare a hourly salary of $29 per hour, and we're going to compare this to, what about, uh, what about $55,000 per annum? So what about you give these a go? Pause the video. I don't think you're going to need to, but if you have to, pause the video and give these a go. If you like this trick, and maybe you currently use it, or maybe you've just learned it and think, hey, that's so easy. Don't just eyeball the like button. Push down hard on it. Declare your love for the Tech Math Channel. Subscribe for more math tricks anyway. Okay, let's get back to our answers. So we only need to really uh, change one of these, but let's do both just for the practice. So what we're going to do to change this into a per hour uh, number is we're going to get rid of the zeros first. Boom, boom, boom. And then we're going to halve our answer. So that is 34. Half of 68 is 34. So as you can see, this one here pays the best okay how much does it pay per year well, let's work that out if we double 35 we get 70 so that pays seventy thousand dollars per year that is such an easy trick um, okay you know what we're going to do here we've got the 29 dollar per hour and the fifty five thousand dollar per annum okay we're going to double this one here we get fifty eight thousand dollars per annum as you can see much much better to earn this one than this one over here, which what this actually earns is we divide 
uh, 55 by 2, we're going to get the answer of 27.5, 27.5, which is going to be $27,500 per annum. Okay, what a really simple trick, right? That's all there is for this video. Do you want more math tricks? Well, we've got plenty of them here at the Tech Math channel. Check out the links in the description below. Hopefully you like that shortcut. It's nice and easy and you can do it instantly. In fact, it's rather ridiculous how fast you can do it. As usual, if you like this trick, don't just serenade the like button. Push it, poke it, do whatever, then subscribe and then leave a comment. My favourite comment last week was somebody saying that I sound like a crocodile would sound if it could speak. I kind of do, I guess, I guess. Can anyone top that? Leave it in the comments. A big shout out to my patrons. Thank you, all of you, all five of you, by signing up. Well, you get nothing special in particular, but what you do is you do help the Tech Math channel, you do support us, and you help me pay my bills. So, you know, I'm pretty happy about that. There is a link in the description if you wish to support my channel via Patreon. It's greatly appreciated. Anyway, we'll see you next time.